I see a function and I see no value of X satisfies the equation. That sounds a whole lot like no solution. Remember, there's only two no solution problems. We have linear no solution in quadratic. This looks like a linear equation because all of my X's are to the power of one. So anytime I get a no solution linear problem, I just put everything in slope intercept form and set my slopes equal. So we kind of treat this like equation one and I treat this like equation two. For equation two, we're gonna have to do some, you know, distributing and combine like terms. I would get three X plus 15 plus five X minus five. So that's gonna get eight X uh, plus 10. So that would be equation two. Equation one was already done. Our slope from equation one is gonna be two A. So again, because there's no solution, my two lines have to be parallel to each other. So I would say 2a from line one is gonna be equal to my slope from line two, which is just gonna be eight. And my a would have to be four for these to have the same slope and therefore be parallel to each other. 